today we are eating um, a very small Korean barbecue. So here I have mushroom, and in here I have Korean pepper paste, spring onions, sesame seed, sesame seed oil, and um, sugar and soya sauce. And this is our dip. And this is perilla leaf. You would wrap your meat inside of this and then you dip it in your sauce or you dip your meat in the sauce and wrap the meat in this and eat it like that. It's not my favorite but I wanted to try it. So I am going to fry these mushrooms over here. So here I am frying some pork belly. There is a Korean shop here that cuts them very very thin. So we always go there to get it. And I'm going to use the same oil to fry the mushrooms. So some are a little bit crispy and some are in between. Yeah, but it's okay. <laughs> and uh, in my other pot, I had some leftover meat. So I just put the Korean pepper paste here with some, um, what do they call it? It's called mirin. Oh, it's a kind of a syrup. Mirin. Yeah, mirin. Or I also use corn syrup. So you got like a sour, sweet sour our flavor yeah. so now I am going to fry my mushroom a little bit of oil on it and a little bit of salt and then you are good to go and mushrooms you can eat also raw it doesn't always have to cook just steam them up nicely and I saw a uh, a trick of how to clean mushrooms you would put your mushrooms after you clean up with your knife and so on put it in uh, a bowl with water and flour and then you rub them together and this is how you can also get your mushrooms clean yeah so this is what we're going to have for dinner sorry about that my hand came like hit the button we are having it also with rice my daughter bought me a rice cooker, so I'm using it. <laughs> yeah. And then um, I made uh, spring onion kimchi. Yeah, so that's well done. That's well fermented. You need those jars, and then it can stay in the fridge for a long time. And then over here we have these nori leaves or seaweed leaves. So we are going to do a lot of wrapping today. I will put my seaweed in here. And we are going to eat that today. And then we are going to have it with some Korean mafioli. Korean rice wine. <laughs> yeah. So that's it for our dinner today. Just wanted to share with you. So let me add some little salt to it. can serve as um, meat substitute. Yeah, so this is our pork belly. <laughs> this is our mushroom. This is our pork <laughs> bone. <laughs> Leftovers. And uh, the sauce here. Then our perilla leaves. And what else? Oh yeah, that nori seaweed and rice. So I hope you like this video. If you do, give it a thumbs up. Feel free to subscribe and to share. And 
Bon appétit, you will see me in my next video.